Drothkuri Dean? Uh, Drothkuri Harry, I thought oh. it, was, it was a third, it was his mate. <laughs> <laughs> Stotty, everyone's like, who's that? Dean Start and Prince Harry have been friends for years. Thank you very much, Henry, for taking your time out. I have no idea what you've got me into, so what, uh. are, you, what are you actually doing? Dean is a British Special Forces veteran, but he's swapping guns for gears to take on a massive charity challenge that will push him to his limit. I'm going to be burning 9,000 calories a day and I need an additional 3,500 on just to stay at this bottom rate. So I need to take on 12,500 calories a day. It's called the Pan American Highway Challenge, a gruelling 14,000 mile bike ride against the clock. We're going to go through the Arctic, we're going to go through the desert, there's even jungle areas and mountainous areas, so that's going to take its toll. All this to raise money and awareness for a mental health campaign. Primary aim, we're going to try and raise awareness for your charity Heads Together, yep. raise a substantial amount of money as well. But Dean needs all the help he can get. How long have you been cycling for? Um, Dean Stott spent 16 years in the British military and special forces. A family man from Scotland, Dean met His Royal Highness Prince Harry on a military training course in 2007. Ever since then, the two soldiers have remained good friends. I think with him and I, that, yeah, there's a, lot of, there's a lot of trust. He knows that I'm here if, if he needs to call or and we can have a bit of banter. At Kensington Palace, Dean is catching up with his old friend to explain his latest adventure. It's called the Pan American Highway Challenge, a world record cycling attempt of nearly 14,000 miles. How long have you got to beat the record when you actually cycle it? The record is 117 days and five hours. 117 days 117 and five hours, you've got to beat that? I've got to beat that, and I'm going for 110 days. But what's, um, what makes you think that you can knock a week off it? Is it just the fact that you've got all of that SF military background yeah, and therefore yeah, men yeah, mentally, yeah, mentally you, are, you are stronger and fitter than, than, than your average person? Yeah, well, yeah, there is that, and the fact that that gives me an advantage already. The route from Argentina to Alaska runs the entire length of the Pan American Highway. It's a daunting ride through mountains, deserts and snowfields. This is a huge undertaking, a proper yeah. challenge that you're, yeah. that you're taking on. Obviously with the military background, yeah. as, you, as you know, if, if there's a planning and training in place, yeah. anything, anything's achievable. Yeah, if you can do all the planning and preparation beforehand, then it should be a... a exactly, and, I, and that's how I'm approaching it. It's almost like a military operation. I love the fact that you're doing it, you know, to, to, to start something from, from fresh. Yeah. You know, having never cycled before, you know, basically in your life, Why cycle? Yeah. Why? Why? Well, why? The, for a personal one for me, I only got into cycling because I had a parachuting injury, so I can no longer run. My, mm. my knee flames, so obviously to, to keep the timber down. Mm. You're also quite just, top heavy. So. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I'm just up your lad. Yeah. All joking aside, Dean has never ridden competitively before. His muscular frame from his time in the SBS isn't suited to long distance cycling. And on top of that, he has just one year to fully prepare himself for what lies ahead. Today, this is the biggest challenge of my life. It's no mean feat. The odds are stacked up. It's not just a physical and mental challenge. Knowing that you're going to be in that saddle for such a long period of time. This challenge will be one of the toughest physical tests Dean has ever faced. But he has all the motivation he needs. Alongside trying to break the world record, Dean will also be trying to raise a million pounds for Heads Together, a mental health campaign fronted by Prince Harry. I mean, obviously, absolutely thrilled that, uh, that you've chosen Heads, Heads Together. But what we're trying to do is bring everybody together 
and trying to start the conversation yeah. about about mental fitness, of course. to encourage them to come forward and and talk about all their all their issues. Because you know, as, you, as, as we yeah. both know, if you catch these uh, things you know early enough, uh, yeah. then then they don't then they don't escalate into into bigger problems. So for you to pick heads together is is so important for us to give us yeah. give it give it that profile. Really, what you and your brother and Kate are doing as well. If it wasn't for you guys, then you know what we weirdly uh, it was what is it last last year when the, the whole conversation started. Yeah, you know it was it was it was coming up in the in the House of Commons. Yeah, I was reading uh, articles in the newspaper. It was on the news. Yeah, lots of bits and pieces, and it was that was the time for us to, to, to come together and say right, let's do something together, the three of us. Yeah, and it needs to be noticed. It needs to be talked about. So all we've done is trying to try to sort of elevate the issue and give it a platform so that we can, you know, start the conversations. Dean has fought alongside the best of the best, but the Pan American Highway Challenge is uncharted territory. For me, it's, it's, yeah, it's, it's, it's an epic challenge. I, I, I don't do anything by halves. One of the mottos of, of the Special Forces is the unrelenting pursuit for excellence. If you're going to do it, you may as well do it to the best of your ability, so why not go all out? Physically, it's going to be hard. Psychologically, it's probably going to be harder. Never cycled before, so yeah, it's, it's going to be really difficult. It's not an easy project. Knowing that I'm going to be raising quite a lot of money, raise awareness of the mental health stigma as well. Because we want to be changing people's lives and the only way we can do that is with support, so I need your help. It's not going to be me on my own cycling, it's going to be me with a lot of people willing me on. This is a record attempt that will help to change lives. Dean knows how much Heads Together means to Prince Harry and the impact their wonderful work can have. So it's no wonder that Prince Harry is wishing his friend all the luck in the world. Dean, I've known you for a long time. This will be an incredible challenge, but I know you can do it. It will be an amazing adventure and push you to the very limits. I want to thank you for making Heads Together your nominated charity for this challenge. You know how important it is to me that we make sure anyone who is struggling feels able to talk openly about it and get the support they need. Your support will help us achieve that. Thank you and good luck. Sorry? Is that happy? One taste. <laughs> 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 <laughs>